Thinking about the future, we often wonder what new technology the next 100 years will bring. But what did the public 100 years ago think the world would be like today? And did any of their predictions come true? Some of their assumptions were remarkably accurate. For instance, people in 1900 were crazy about photography. They imagined that in the 21st century, we'd be able to take a picture on one side of the world, sending the same picture to the other side of the world in less than one hour. Try less than one second. They believed that telephones would be wireless, letting us talk on the phone anywhere. And that using moving pictures, we'd be able to communicate with people all over the world. They thought we would tour the country driving houses on wheels. And that fed up with doing our own cleaning, we would clean our homes automatically using electric scrubbers. Other predictions didn't quite work out. They thought that a college education would be free for everyone. Aware of the danger posed by mosquitoes, they believed we would have killed them all. And believing in the power of modern medicine, they were sure that we would have put an end to cancer. Some predictions sort of came true. They were curious about air travel back then, and lots of people thought we'd have flying cars by now. And while that prediction hasn't come true, there certainly are many people commuting to work in the morning by airplane these days. They thought store purchases would arrive quickly, traveling through tubes connected to every home. Today, we get our purchases fast all right, but they usually come on a truck. And they thought students might learn by wires connecting their brains to machines. Well, there's no electricity flowing to the heads of our students, but our classrooms today are certainly wired. So, what about the future? What do people familiar with how much has changed in the last 100 years think the world will be like in 2100? 100 years from now? I think we'll all be just hanging out, letting robots do all the work. I imagine we won't get sick anymore, having figured out how to cure all diseases. Before you go to sleep, you tell a computer what you want to dream about that night. And while you're sleeping, it guides your dreams. Mm, no more cars. I'm sick of cars. We'll all be completely reliant on public transportation. Cars will drive themselves. Two words. Flying cars. It always seems to come back to flying cars, doesn't it? But who knows, maybe this time that prediction will come true. For Channel 4 News, I'm Gene Mackey.